When talking about prehistoric animals, there is no way there is anyone who has not heard of the megalodon shark. However, no matter how dangerous this animal is, a group of scientists managed to find out that even more dangerous animals have lived in the sea in the past. In this way, today in this video we will talk about the species of shark known as red megalodon, as well as many other dangerous animals that lived in the sea in the past. First, we are going to talk in detail about the dangerous red megalodon sharks that lived in our world from the past. That way, sharks living today usually only grow to between 5 and 7 feet. But when hammerhead sharks grow to a length of 11 feet, we can see that the largest and most dangerous shark in the world, the Great White, easily exceeds 20 feet in length. But we will not be able to keep this one type of shark or a megalodon type shark near. In this way, it is reported that this megalodon-type shark is about 60 centimeters long. Therefore, T. rex dinosaurs became the top predator that lived on land during prehistoric times. This megalodon shark has become an even more elite type of predator. Also, it is reported that the strength that this shark can use its mouth to chew something is equal to the force of about 40,000 pounds per square inch. Because this is the highest supply power that scientists have ever estimated for an animal, then it will be clear to you how powerful this animal is. Even if a human usually hits us, it hurts us a lot, but a human can only cut with a maximum force of 160 pounds per square inch. Then it becomes clear to us how strong the chewing power of that animal is. Also, in the recent tests conducted by scientists, they have been able to see that the teeth of these megalodon-type sharks have sunk into the bones in the bones of the big whales that lived in the water in prehistoric times. With that, we can find evidence that these animals have attacked all other animals that lived in the ocean in the past. Also, these megalodon-type sharks attack their prey in a very different way than the sharks living in our world today. In this way, the sharks that live today attack their prey from hiding and dive directly under the water, but this megalodon shark attacks its prey from under the water and quickly rises to the surface, destroys the prey and goes under the water. But you may not have known before the meeting that there were two types of megalodon sharks, gray megalodon sharks and red megalodon sharks. It is reported that gray megalodon sharks, which become one of the most dangerous sharks, have eaten anything they caught in the past. But the type of shark that acted as the leaders among the megalodon type sharks that we talked about before is known as the red megalodon type shark. Finally, these animals have hunted so well that they have lost even one species of predator that can stand against them and finally these animals have started to destroy each other by themselves. For that reason, no matter how powerful the shark species is, we are not able to see these animals in our world today. But because these red megalodon sharks are very fast and their body strength is more than the normal megalodon sharks. Among the megalodon sharks, they have become the last shark species that lived in the ocean. Did you ever know that there were two types of megalodon sharks, the new and the red, and that the red megalodon was the most dangerous? Next, we are talking about prehistoric animals called Sarcosicus, another animal race that was just as dangerous as this megalodon. If asked to name the most dangerous predators currently living in our freshwater reservoirs as well as saltwater reservoirs, many people think of crocodiles. In the same way, in the past of our world, an ancestor of crocodiles lived in the present, which is very dangerous. This prehistoric animal that lived on land as well as in reservoirs lived between 95 and 115 million years ago. Today, due to the facts found in the tests done on this animal, these crocodiles are considered to be the largest species of crocodiles that have ever lived in this world. It has been determined from the fossils found by the scientists that this species of crocodile, which had a large head of about 2 meters, has increased to 30 feet in total length. Also, the crocodiles that live today are after they have grown to a certain size. It didn't get bigger after that. 
Scientists have also managed to find that the species of crocodiles we are talking about has continued to grow as long as they have been alive. Because of that reason, scientists have sometimes been able to find animals of this type that are about 40 feet long from the fossils they have found. Although the scientists had not found the exact length of the teeth of these animals, it is reported that this animal has about 35 sharp teeth on one side of its upper jaw and 31 teeth on one side of its lower jaw. Although scientists had not guessed that there were fights between this type of animals and megalodon-type animals, we can call this animal as another prehistoric animal that became a very dangerous threat to other animals like this brick. Next, we are talking about a prehistoric creature in the ocean called Liviatan, which is considered to be as dangerous as this megalodon. If people believe how big this animal was, people speculate that they could become the main enemy of these megalodon sharks. And we can say from prehistoric findings that both these types of animals have lived in the sea during the same time interval. It looks similar to the sperm whales that live in the ocean today. Scientists have not yet been able to estimate the exact size of this dangerous animal we are talking about. It is reported that although scientists were able to find a fossil of this type of animal for the first time in 2008, Scientists could not guess the size of the body because only the head was left at that time. That's why scientists have made a lot of guesses about these animals by checking the size of the head. In this way, scientists now say that this animal species was about 44 feet long and it is estimated to have weighed about 50 tons. Currently, the largest tooth found in this type of animal is 16 inches long so you can understand how big their single tooth is. We can also say that this value is twice the size of a T-Rex dinosaur's tooth. Because of the similarity between these sizes and because they lived in the same time period, the scientists speculate that this type of animal and the megalodon shark must have fought for food during this time. That's why the scientists who tested who would win in a fight between these two animals were able to find the advantages and disadvantages of both types of animals. In that way, because these megalodon-type sharks are hunted in herds and they are very quarrelsome, they have one advantage from that side. But because the whales living today are also very intelligent, the fact that this type of animal that lived in the past also has a good intelligence may be another advantage for that animal. Doing however, scientists are currently speculating that the megalodon-type shark may have won every time due to its chewing power. Next we are talking about another most dangerous prehistoric animal that lived in the ocean called Basilosaurus. First, after the fossil scientists found this animal, they used this name for this type of animal because of a species of reptile that is a little similar in shape to this animal living in Mexico. But later, scientists were able to find that instead of being a reptile, it was a species of whale that lived in the ocean. They did not change the previous name. It is reported that this species of animals that we are talking about, which lived on Earth between 39 and 45 million years ago, was between 44 and 66 feet in length. That's why even though it is actually a whale, we have been able to take care of this animal more like a baby. Also, since almost all the teeth found in the fossils of these animals are very worn, scientists speculate that these animals must have chewed their prey after catching it without swallowing it at once. And after scientists managed to find a complete fossil of this type of animal in Egypt, the scientists were able to find the bones of other sharks and several other animals inside the stomach of this fossil. It confirmed to the scientists that this species has eaten even sharks that lived in the past. However, scientists have found that although this species of animal is a species of whale, they did not have intelligence like the whales that live today. The reason for that is because their brain size is much smaller than the palm fishes that live today. Have you ever known about such a dangerous prehistoric animal before? In today's video, we talked about many other animals that were more dangerous than the megalodon sharks that lived in our world in prehistoric times. Looking at it that way, for so long we have thought that these megalodon sharks are dangerous. 
It must be clear to you now that there are species among these animals and that red megalodon sharks are very dangerous. In this way, in the prehistoric era that we talked about in this video today, comment below and tell us about which animal you were most surprised to learn about, among the many other animals that lived in our world that were more dangerous than the megalodon sharks. Also, if you think this video is good and you have gained knowledge, don't forget to like the video, comment and share and support us. Just like this, we will meet soon in another latest video. Good day.